Writing is something that I love to do. I publish my story on an app to get reviews. It makes me feel alive when I know the world around me will crumble. I walk on a tightrope of words, yet I still stumble. It's taken years for my mind to expand. Becoming creative is hard when the words won't flow out of your hand. I write for fun, to inspire, and to kill all my stress. But people write stories for other reasons. I'll let you take a guess. There are stories in the media that are there only to start trouble. Random words thrown together. I call it word rubble. It's rubbish and it's useless, but everyone still believes. They steal their victims' dignity like hardcore thieves. They are riding the wreck and it's destroying our economy. The victims are waiting to roar. Deep inside their hearts, they want to express their autonomy. They write their disgusting stories, maybe to get a pay rise, or most likely, for that delicious slice of pie. But that delicious slice of pie is thousands of dollars. While they take all that money, there are echoes of screams and hollers. Here's a story. Once there was an innocent young lady. She made some mistakes, even though she was brainy. There were lies made up about her in the media. It was like an essay, the whole encyclopedia. She became sad, she became mad as she looked at her iPad, but then she felt a rush of blood. She knew that she could prove the world wrong. She said, I am still strong. She began to sing her beautiful song, Stop riding the wreck, we all belong. It doesn't matter if you're not that tall, you might get it from your parents, you're probably small. It doesn't matter if you're not her size. Who, why can't we just look each other in the eyes? It doesn't matter if you're not as fit as him and stop looking at him with your eyes full of prim. I'm losing faith in humanity, so just listen to me. Save my sanity. She rose up against them and stopped the negative writing. Instead of fighting, she used her words like lightning. So come and help. Become a hero. Nobody wants to be an absolute zero. I decided to write this when I was laying on my deck. I said, I'm going to stop people from writing the wreck.